Austin from Monster here with another Creature Feature, an in-depth look at the unique fragrances on offer by Monster Flesh and Maine. Of all the big monsters out there, Frankenstein's monster has always been my favorite. So when I set out to make a fragrance dedicated to Frankenstein's monster, I knew I had to use my favorite essential oils. Cedar, bergamot, and frankincense. Originally, also pine. I don't know, it just never felt right with the pine. So, you know, we took it out. Cedar and bergamot lay a nice foundation of wood and citrus for this fragrance, but by far, the star of the show is that frankincense. If you've never smelled real frankincense before, the stuff in candles and incense is all fake these days. It may not be what you expect. It's bold, spicy, resinous. If I really had to nail it down, and I do, obviously that's the point of this video, I would say it smells like a stringed instrument. You know, like a violin. Wood, a bit metallic, and with that, that resin scent in there, like from the bow. Symphonic! That's better. Let's say it smells symphonic. It's a very weird scent. But I figure if you're currently trying to decide what monster you want your beard to smell like, you're probably kind of a weird guy. Our kind of people. Not everyone loves frankincense, but man, I sure do. I mean, there's a reason that in antiquity, this stuff was so highly prized that it's one of three gifts given to the living embodiment of God himself. And if you'd like a beard scent that's good enough for the baby Jesus, Go to the URL below and check out the creature. And while you're at it, check out all of our other creature features. See what else you might like. There's a lot of them out there.